The community of Wahoo is mourning the loss of a fifth grade boy who died after being hit by a pickup truck while walking home from school yesterday afternoon. Today, the district is trying to help students and staff cope after the tragic death of 11 year old Mason Triplett. Came TV Action 3 News reporter Shante Passmore is live in Wahoo with more in the story. Shante. Emily Matt just got off the phone with Wahoo Police. They say the driver involved in this deadly crash is from Omaha. His name is Sean Buffum. Everywhere I went today in Wahoo, not a dry eye who knew who remembered Mason Triplett very well. And just right behind me is Mason's elementary school. The superintendent of the Wahoo School District describes the mood there as somber. Always smiling. That's how family friends remembered Mason. Best described him. These are some of the first pictures we're seeing of the fifth grader who attended Wahoo Elementary. Elementary. Saunders County Sheriff's deputies say a pickup truck hit him near 23rd and Chestnut as he walked home from school yesterday afternoon. Paramedics rushed him to the hospital where he later died. The Wahoo School District called in grief counselors today for staff and students. Superintendent Brandon Lavalley says the counselors have met with several students already today and says this loss is hurting both the Warriors school community and the town. The biggest thing I, I would just continue to encourage the community to rally around the family. Uh, you know, it's, it's hard to imagine what that'd be like to go through that. And so far, it, it's certainly been a positive response in that direction. Right now, we're still waiting to hear whether the Saunders County Attorney's Office will file any charges. And there is a GoFundMe page set up for the Triplett family to help with the funeral uh, services expenses. That information is on our website. You can just head over to KMTV.com. Reporting live in Wahoo, Shante Passmore, KMTV, Action 3 News Midday. Thanks, Shante. Today, the family of Mason Triplett released a statement saying in part, quote, we lost a great boy from our lives yesterday. Mason was a caring brother, son, grandson, and friend. We appreciate all the support from the community and surrounding communities, and we ask for peace and privacy while we heal during this difficult time. We also want to reach out to the driver and ask for everyone to pray and support their family during this tragedy.